Kebabs are various cooked meat dishes, with their origins in Middle Eastern cuisine. Many variants are popular throughout Asia, and around the world. In most English-speaking countries, a kebab is commonly the internationally known shish kebab or shashlik, though outside of North America a kebab may be the ubiquitous fast food doner kebab or its variants. In contrast, in Indian English and in the languages of the Middle East, other parts of Asia, and the Muslim world, a kebab is any of a wide variety of grilled meat dishes. Some dishes ultimately derived from Middle Eastern kebab may have different names in their local languages, such as the Chinese chuan r. Although kebabs are often cooked on a skewer, many types of kebab are not. Kebab dishes can consist of cut up or ground meat or seafood, sometimes with fruits and vegetables, cooked on a skewer over a fire, or like a hamburger on a grill, baked in a pan in an oven, or as a stew, and served with various accompaniments according to each recipe. The traditional meat for kebabs is most often mutton or lamb, but regional recipes may include beef, goat, chicken, fish, or more rarely due to religious prohibitions, pork. History Evidence of hominin use of fire and cooking in the Middle East dates back as far as 790,000 years, and prehistoric hearths, earth ovens, and burnt animal bones were spread across Europe and the Middle East by at least 250,000 years ago. In ancient times, Homer in the Iliad mentions pieces of meat roasted on spits, obelos and excavations in Santorini unearthed stone supports for skewers used before the 17th century BC. Kebab dishes originated in the medieval kitchens of Persia and Turkey. They were generally made with smaller chunks or slices of meat, or ground meat, often cooked on skewers over a fire. This cooking method has a long history in the region, where it would be practical in cities where small cuts of meat were available in butchers' shops, and where fuel for cooking was relatively scarce, compared to Europe, where extensive forests enabled farmers to roast large cuts of meat whole. The word kebab, most likely of Arabic origin, came to English in the late 17th century partly through Urdu, Persian, and Turkish. In Ibn Sayyar al Waraku's 10th century cookbook Kitab al Tabak, kebab is described as cut up meat either fried in a pan or grilled over a fire. According to linguist Seven Nisanyan, the Turkish word kebab is also derived from the Arabic word kebab, meaning roasted meat. It appears in Turkish texts as early as the 14th century, in Kisa i Yusuf, the story of Joseph, though still in the Arabic form. Nisanyan states that the word has the equivalent meaning of frying, burning, with kebabu. In the Old Akkadian language, and kebaba ke in Aramaic, the American Heritage Dictionary also gives a probable East Semitic root origin with the meaning of burn, char, or roast from the Aramaic and Akkadian. These words point to an origin in the prehistoric Proto Afroasiatic language, asterisk kab, to burn or roast. According to Ibn Battuta, a Moroccan traveller, in India, kebab was served in the royal houses during the Delhi Sultanate period, 1206 to 1526 AD, and even commoners would enjoy it for breakfast with naan. <laughs> National varieties Africa Suya is a spicy kebab which is a popular food item in West Africa. It is traditionally prepared by the Hausa people of northern Nigeria, Cameroon, Niger, Ghana and some parts of Sudan where it is called agashi. Kainkinga is common and popular in West Africa. It is a Ghanaian dish, very similar to or synonymous with the Hausa Suya kebab, also known as Suya, Singa, Chichinga, Sire Agashi, Chachanga or Tankora. Sasati is a traditional South African dish of meat usually lamb or mutton cooked on skewers. The term derives from sat, skewered meat, and saus spicy sauce. It is of Cape Malay origin. Sasati recipes vary, but commonly the ingredients can include cubes of lamb, beef, chicken, dried apricots, red onions and mixed peppers. Afghanistan Afghan kebab pashto, dari, kebab is most often found in restaurants and outdoor vendor stalls. The most widely used meat is lamb. Recipes differ with every restaurant. 
Afghan kebab is served with naan, rarely rice, and customers have the option to sprinkle sumac or gora, dried ground sour grapes, on their kebab. The quality of kebab is solely dependent on the quality of the meat. Pieces of fat from the sheep's tail are usually added with the lamb skewers to add extra flavor. Other popular kebabs include the lamb chop, ribs, beef, buffalo, and chicken, all of which are found in better restaurants. Chapli kebab, a specialty of eastern Afghanistan, is a patty made from beef mince. It is a popular barbecue meal in Afghanistan. The word chapli comes from the Pashto word chaprik, which means flat. It is prepared flat and round, and served with naan. The original recipe of chapli kebab dictates a half meat or less, half flour mixture, which renders it lighter in taste and less expensive. Armenia Korovits Armenian, Zorovak is a dish of pieces of meat grilled on flat skewers known as shish or shampur. It is very popular, especially on festive occasions. In contrast to shish kebab, the meat pieces are typically larger, and left on the bone. While sometimes coated in salt, pepper, onions, and herbs shortly before cooking, vinegar-based marinades are not used. Various kinds of meat are used, the most common is pork, with ribs being the most popular cut. Vegetables are not cooked on the same skewer. Seasoned oblong meatballs cooked on skewers, known in other regions as lul kebab or kuft, are called kayabab, with the emphasis on the first syllable. Karsi Korovits is the Armenian name for Donar kebab, which the city of Kars became known for during the time of the Ottoman Empire. Azerbaijan In the Republic of Azerbaijan, the main varieties include tikka kebab, layula kebab, doima kebab in some places, tas kebabi and tava kebab. The meat for tikka kebab is sometimes prepared in bazderma an onion gravy and, thyme and then goes onto the skewers. It may be served, wrapped in lavash, with sauce like pomegranate adon and other condiments. Topic. Bangladesh In Bangladesh there are various types of kebabs Bengali kebaba or kebab. In the old Bengal Subha capital of Dhaka, various Persian and Arab-influenced dishes started to be made. Amongst these were kebabs. In Bangladesh most kebabs are made using beef whereas its Indian Bengali neighbours use chicken or mutton to make it. Amongst the popular kebabs are Bulgaria In Bulgaria, the word kebab, kebab is a generic term for meat stews with few or no vegetables. The doner kebab is widespread as fast food and is called dune Shish kebab, shashlik is also common, and is called sis shishchi, small skewer. China. Chuan R Chinese, Chuan Pinyin, Chuan, often referred to as Chuer throughout the north, or Kawap Kavap in Uyghur, is a variation of kebab originating from the Uyghur people in the western province of Xinjiang and a popular dish in Chinese Islamic cuisine. The dish has since spread across the rest of the country and become a popular street food. Although the most traditional form of Chuan R uses lamb or mutton, other types of meat, such as chicken, beef, pork, and seafood, may be used as well. Small pieces of meat are skewered and either roasted or deep fried. Common spices and condiments include cumin called zurin, pepper, sesame, and sesame oil. Topic: <inaudible> Greece. While the history of street foods in Greece goes back to ancient times, the iconic Greek gyros and souvlaki as it is known today arose only following the Second World War. Introduced to Athens in the 1950s by immigrants from Turkey and the Middle East, gyros was originally known simply as doner kebab. It is typically served as a sandwich rolled in pita bread, or on a plate, with French fries and various salads and sauces such as tzatziki. 
Later in the 1960s, vendors also began selling dishes in the same style made with souvlaki, which resembles Turkish shish kebab, but is usually made with pork. Around the same time, the Greek word gyros replaced doner kebab, and the Greek style of the dish spread to become popular, particularly in North America, and various other parts of the world. In contrast to other areas of Greece, in Athens, both types of sandwich may be called souvlaki, with the skewered meat being called kalamaki. Although gyros is unquestionably of Middle Eastern origin, the issue of whether modern-day souvlaki came to Greece via Turkish cuisine, and should be considered a Greek styling of shish kebab, or as a contemporary revival of Greek tradition dating as far back as 17th century BC Minoan civilization, is a topic of sometimes heated debate, at least between Greeks and Turks. While English speakers may refer to souvlaki skewers as kebabs, they are not properly called that in Greece. India Ancient Hindu texts, such as Mahabharata, mention a dish made of marinated game meats roasted on large, open fires. Modern-day kebabs in India trace their origin to the influence of the Mughlai cuisine in India. Some varieties of kebab in India are more or less similar to other kebab preparations along with their distinct taste, which can be credited to the use of the Indian spices. Though there are certain distinct versions like tunda ke kebab, tikka kebab, shami kebab, suvar ki sant pork belly kebabs from Rajasthan and rajputi sula, which are native to India. Also, owing to widespread prevalence of vegetarianism in India, there are many local, vegetarian varieties of kebab, made from paneer or potato. All the varieties such as shish, doner known as shawarma, shami, tikka, and other forms of roasted and grilled meats are savoured in India. Some popular kebabs are Topic <inaudible> Indonesia Kebab in Indonesia are the same as other kebab Indonesian kebab are served as dinner Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Iran There are several distinct Persian varieties of kebab Persian Kebab may be served with either steamed, saffron basmati or Persian rice and called chilo kebab, klu kebab which is considered the national dish of Iran. It may also be served with the various types of bread that are the most commonly eaten in Iran, such as lavash. It is served with the basic Iranian meal accompaniments, in addition to grilled tomatoes on the side of the rice and butter on top of the rice. It is an old northern tradition probably originating in Tehran that a raw egg yolk should be placed on top of the rice as well, though this is strictly optional, and most restaurants will not serve the rice this way unless it is specifically requested. Soma, powdered sumac, is also made available and its use varies based on tastes to a small dash on the rice or a heavy sprinkling on both rice and meat, particularly when used with red beef, veal, lamb meat. At Persian restaurants, the combination of one kebab barg and one kebab kubade is typically called sultani, meaning, sultan's feast. The traditional beverage of choice to accompany kebab is dew, a sour yogurt drink with mint and salt. In the old bazaar tradition, the rice which is covered with a tin lid and accompaniments are served first, immediately followed by the kebabs, which are brought to the table by the waiter, who holds several skewers in his left hand, and a piece of flat bread typically nan -e -lavash in his right. A skewer is placed directly on the rice and while holding the kebab down on the rice with the bread, the skewer is quickly pulled out. With the two most common kebabs, barg and kubade, two skewers are always served. In general, bazaar kebab restaurants only serve these two varieties, though there are exceptions. In Iranian Azerbaijan, Binab also Binab kebabi is very famous in Azerbaijani cuisine for its large size. It is named after the city of Binab in East Azerbaijan province. This kebab and other types e.g., shishlik, cubide, burj, jelen, etc. can be served alone or with rice and fresh salad on the side. In this region kebabs come usually with yogurt, hot bread, tomato, onion, parsley and paprika salt, and tarragon. Kebab kubade kebab kwebid it kubide kwebid is an Iranian minced meat kebab which is made from ground lamb, beef, or chicken, often mixed with parsley and chopped onions. Kebab kubade contains, ground meat, onion, salt, pepper, turmeric, and seasoning. These ingredients are mixed together until the mixture becomes smooth and sticky. One egg is added to help the mix stick together. The mixture is then pressed around a skewer. 
Kubade kebab is typically 18 to 20 cm (7 to 8 in) long. Kebab e barg Persian kebab berg is a Persian style barbecued lamb, chicken, or beef kebab dish. The main ingredients of kebab barg, a short form of this name, are fillets of beef tenderloin, lamb shank or chicken breast, onions, and olive oil. Marinade is prepared by the mixture of half a cup of olive oil, three onions, garlic, half teaspoon saffron, salt, and black pepper. One kilogram of lamb is cut into one centimeter thick and four to five centimeters long pieces. It should be marinated overnight in refrigerator, and the container should be covered. The next day, the lamb is threaded on long, thin metal skewers. It is brushed with marinade and is barbecued for 5 to 10 minutes on each side. Kebab e barg Juje kebab kebab consists of pieces of chicken first marinated in minced onion and lemon juice with saffron then grilled over a fire. It is sometimes served with grilled tomato and pepper. Juje kebab is one of the most popular Persian dishes. Kebab bakhtiari is a combination of juje kebab, chicken kebab and kebab barg beef or lamb meat on the same skewer. Its name comes from the bakhtiari region of Iran. Kebab kenje, also known as chenje kebab is a kebab traditionally made with chunks of marinated lamb meat. It is typically served with grilled tomatoes and rice or bread. Iraq Several types of kebab are popular in Iraq, although the word kebab in local use is reserved for skewers of spiced ground lamb, traditionally grilled on natural wood charcoal to give the kebab its special flavor. Skewers of grilled marinated meat chunks are called tikka, the most popular of which is the chicken tikka. Kebabs in Iraq are consumed any time of the day, including for breakfast. Israel. Mizrahi Jews brought various types of grilled meat from their native Middle Eastern lands to Israel, where they are an essential part of the Israeli cuisine. Among the most popular are skewers of elongated spiced ground meat, called kebab Hebrew, cube kebab, which have become a staple dish of the Israeli meat restaurants and the main dish of the traditional Israeli holiday barbecue, alongside the shishlik. They are commonly made of beef, though lamb is also occasionally used, and are almost always served with the local pita bread, hummus and vegetable salads. The Levant and Egypt Several varieties of kebabs can be found at most restaurants representing this region. Among the most common are shish tauk, which are grilled chicken skewers marinated in olive oil and spices, and lahem meshwi, charcoal grilled skewers of prime lamb cubes lightly seasoned with herbs. Shawarma, although not considered a kebab in most countries of the Levant and Egypt, is another very popular type of grilled meat preparation that characterizes this region. <laughs> Nepal In Nepal it is a popular dish in Nepalese cuisine as well as Newa cuisine and known as sakua. It is a meat roasted in a natural wood, log fire in a real traditional Nepalese country style. At first while the meat is still in its raw stage is mixed with homemade natural herbs and spices and other necessary ingredients. Sakua could be of pork, lamb, goat or chicken, or a mixture. Sakua is very popular in Nepal, especially in the eastern Nepal and Kathmandu. Tarahara, a small town in Sunsari district of Koshi state in the eastern Nepal could be called as the Sakua capital of Nepal. Pakistan Kebabs in Pakistan trace their origin to the influence of the Mughlai cuisine. Pakistani cuisine has different kebabs. Meat including beef, buff, chicken, lamb and fish is used in kebabs. Some popular kebabs are Chapli kebab Bodhi kebab Bun kebab Reshmi kebab Shami kebab Sikh kebab Southeast Asia Satay is a kebab of seasoned, skewered, and grilled meat, served with a sauce. 
It is a dish of Southeast Asia, particularly Indonesia, Malaysia, and Thailand. Satay may consist of diced or sliced chicken, goat, lamb, mutton, beef, pork, fish, other meats, or tofu. Traditionally skewers from the midrib of the coconut palm frond are used, although bamboo skewers are often used instead. It is grilled or barbecued over a wood or charcoal fire with spicy seasonings. It may be served with various sauces, though most often a combination of soy and peanut sauce. Hence, peanut sauce is often called satay sauce. Satay was developed by Javanese street vendors as a unique adaptation of Indian kebab. The introduction of satay, and other now iconic dishes such as tongseng and gulai kambing based on meats such as goat and lamb, coincided with an influx of Indian and Arab traders and immigrants starting in the 18th century. It is available almost anywhere in Indonesia, where it has become a national dish. In Sri Lanka, it has become a staple of the local diet as a result of the influences from the local Malay community. Turkey Shish kebab is a dish consisting of small cubes of meat or fish threaded on a skewer and grilled. Sis, pronounced I, is a Turkish word meaning sword or skewer. Tradition has it that the dish was invented by medieval soldiers who used their swords to grill meat over open field fires. In Turkey, shish kebab does not normally contain vegetables, though they may be cooked on a separate skewer. It can be prepared with lamb, beef, chicken, or fish, but pork is not used. Kag kebabi is similar to doner kebab, but cooked on a horizontal spit rather than vertical. It is associated with the eastern Turkish province of Erzurum. Doner kebab, literally, rotating kebab, in Turkish, is sliced lamb, beef, or chicken, slowly roasted on a vertical rotating spit. The Middle Eastern shawarma, Mexican tacos al pastor, and Greek gyros are all derived from the Turkish doner kebab, which was invented in Bursa in the 19th century. The German style doner kebab sandwich, sometimes called simply a kebab in English, was introduced by Turkish immigrants in Berlin in the 1970s, and has become one of the most popular takeaway foods in Germany and much of Europe. It is commonly sold by Turks, and considered a Turkish German specialty, in Germany. Iskender kebab is a dish made with doner kebab meat, served with tomato sauce, melted butter, and yogurt, on pita bread. It is named after a cook from Bursa who is often credited with the invention of the doner kebab. Adana kebabi, or kima kebabi is a long, hand-minced meat kebab mounted on a wide iron skewer and grilled over charcoal. It is generally hot or piquant. The traditional adana kebab is made using lamb, with a high fatty content cooked over hot coals. Only three ingredients are used in a proper adana kebab, minced lamb, red capsicum pepper, and salt. Steam kebab Turkish, bugu kebabi, is a Turkish stew which is cooked in a pan or an earthenware casserole. The casserole's lid is sealed in order to cook the meat in its own juices. The dish is prepared with pearl onions, garlic, thyme, and other spices. In Tekirdag, it is served with cumin, in Izmir, it is served with mastic. Testi kebab is a dish from central Anatolia and the mid-western Black Sea region, consisting of a mixture of meat and vegetables cooked in a clay pot or jug over fire testi means jug in Turkish. The pot is sealed with bread dough or foil and is broken when serving. Other variants Bara Bara kebab is another kebab from India. This is usually made of goat or lamb meat, liberally marinated with spices and charcoal grilled. It uses cuts of chops and not other meat cuts. Savapi Savapi pronounced TV pi or sivapchichi formal diminutive TV aptiti sivapchichi which comes from the word kebab is a grilled dish of minced meat a type of skinless sausage found traditionally in the countries of southeastern Europe the Balkans they are considered a national dish in Bosnia and Herzegovina and Serbia and are also common in Croatia, Kosovo, Montenegro, Albania, Slovenia, as well as in Republic of Macedonia, Bulgaria, Romania. Savapi has its origins in the Balkans during the Ottoman period, and represents a regional speciality similar to the koft kebab. A dish with similar origins is in Romania called midite. Topic. 
Topic: <laughs> Chapli. Chapli kebab is a patty made from beef mince, onions, tomatoes, green chilies, coriander seeds, cumin seeds, salt, black pepper, lemon juice or pomegranate seeds, eggs, cornstarch and coriander leaves. Chapli kebab is a common dish in Pashtun cuisine and popular in Afghanistan, Pakistan. The kebab originates in Afghanistan. Martin is famous for chapli kebab not only locally but also internationally. Chapli kebab is prepared flat and round and generally served with naan. The word chapli comes from the Pashto word chaprik, which means flat. Topic: <laughs> Galuti. The galuti kebab is a dish originating from the Indian subcontinent made of minced goat and green papaya. It was supposedly made for a Nawab in Lucknow who could not eat the regular kebabs due to weak teeth. Like Lucknowi biryani and Kakori kebab, it is a hallmark of Awadi cuisine. Many leading Indian hotel chains have taken to popularizing the Awadi food tradition, with the Galuti kebab being a pièce de résistance. The home of this kebab is Lucknow. It is most famously had at the almost iconic eatery, Tundi Mian, at Old Lucknow. Kakori Kakori kebab is an Indian kebab attributed to the city of Kakori in Uttar Pradesh, India. The kebab is made of finely ground minced goat meat with spices and then charcoal grilled on a skewer. It is commonly served with rumali roti a very thin bread, onion and a mint chutney sauce. The meat is ground to a fine paste and kept moist so the texture is soft. There is a legend that it was first prepared for old and toothless pilgrims. Topic: <laughs> Kalmi. Kalmi kebab a popular snack in Indian cuisine. The dish is made by marinating chicken drumsticks and placing them in a tandoor. Various kinds of freshly ground Indian spices are added to the yogurt used for the marination of the chicken. When prepared, the drumsticks are usually garnished with mint leaves and served with onions and Indian bread. Topic: <inaudible> Kebab halabi. A kind of kebab served with a spicy tomato sauce and Aleppo pepper, very common in Syria and Lebanon, named after the city of Aleppo, Halab. Kebab halabi has around 26 variants including Kebab karaz cherry kebab in Arabic, meatballs lamb along with cherries and cherry paste, pine nuts, sugar and pomegranate molasses. It is considered one of Aleppo's main dishes. Kebab kashkash, rolled lamb or beef with chili pepper paste, parsley, garlic and pine nuts. Kebab hindi, rolled meat with tomato paste, onion, capsicum and pomegranate molasses. Kebab kamaya, soft meat with truffle pieces, onion and various nuts. Kebab sinye, tray kebab in Arabic, lean minced lamb in a tray added with chili pepper, onion and tomato. Pinchitos Pinchitos or pinchos morunos is a Moorish-derived kebab dish in Spanish cuisine. The name pinchitos is used in the southern Spanish autonomous communities of Andalusia and Extremadura. They consist of small cubes of meat threaded onto a skewer Spanish, pincho, which are traditionally cooked over charcoal braziers. Similar dishes in North Africa or other Muslim-majority countries tend to be lamb-based, but pork and chicken are the most popular meats for the dish in Spain. Pinchitos are also extremely popular in Venezuela, due to the heavy influence Spain had in Venezuelan cuisine during many years. Shashlik Shashlik is similar to, or sometimes a synonym for, shish kebab. It is popular in many countries, particularly in Eastern and Central Europe, the Caucasus, and the Baltics. In non-Muslim majority countries, shashlik and equivalent dishes like Romanian frigorui may sometimes be prepared with pork. Kebab in Western culture Kebab cuisine has spread around the world together with Muslim influence. 
Although non-Muslim Westerners may be increasingly familiar with some of the many other international kebab dishes, only two have become an established and widely popular part of the culture in many Western countries. In English, the word kebab commonly refers to shish kebab and, outside of North America, to doner kebab or related fast food dishes. These dishes are also served in many other countries, where they may have different names. Shish kebab In English, kebab, often occurring as shish kebab, is now a culinary term for small pieces of meat cooked on a skewer. The word kebab, most likely derived from Arabic, has been used with various spellings in this sense since at least the 17th century, while the Oxford English Dictionary records the earliest known publication of the term shish kebab, derived from Turkish, sis kebab, in 1914. In many English speaking countries, it refers to the now well known dish prepared with marinated meat or seafood together with vegetables such as onions, tomatoes, and bell peppers threaded onto the skewer, also sometimes known as shashlik. This preparation is different from the typical Turkish shish kebab style, where vegetables are usually cooked on a separate skewer. Shish kebabs are customarily prepared in homes and restaurants, and are usually cooked on a grill or barbecue, or roasted in an oven. The word kebab may also be used as a general term in English to describe any similar-looking skewered food, such as brochette, satay, souvlaki, yakitori, or numerous small chunks of any type of food served on a stick. This is different from its use in the Middle East, where shish Persian, Mazandarani, shish Turkish, sis is the word for skewer, while kebab comes from the word for grilling. <laughs> Doner kebab English speakers from countries outside North America may also use the word kebab generally to mean the popular fast food version of the Turkish doner kebab, or the related shawarma or gyros, and the sandwiches made with them, available from kebab shops as takeaway meals. This usage may be found in some non-English parts of Europe as well. In North America, the Greek variant gyros is most widely known. The doner kebab originated in 19th century Turkey, but it became widely popular in the West only in the latter half of the 20th century. Many layers of meat are stacked onto a large vertical rotating spit, the outer surface is gradually cooked and sliced off, and typically served as a sandwich in pita or flatbread with salad and sauces. Sandwiches served in the same manner, but with other meats or cheese, may also sometimes be called a kebab. It is available in most parts of Europe, and many other countries, though sometimes with different names or serving styles. In Germany, the highly popular sandwich, introduced by Turkish immigrants, is called a doner, though Arab shops there serve shawarma. <laughs> Similar dishes <laughs> See also